Hello everyone and welcome back to NAMS our channel. So today I'm getting two videos done in one day. Today is Sunday. It is uh, February 6th and I just decided that maybe you guys would like to see what I have in my art pencil case here. So I'm just going to share that with you guys by opening it. Voila! <laughs> okay, so as you can see, I have a whole bunch of different things in here. So I'm just going to take this out and just try to separate it as much as I can right now. So I have my markers here. I have my micron pens. I have my pens to sign my work with. I'm just going to separate this for you guys so you can actually get to see everything that I have in my kit when I travel and go to appointments and such. All right. So I'm just going to take a little bit of time to set all of this up. So I am completely happy with my kit here. It's just very convenient to put it in this case. And it just works for me, y'all. It just works for me. What can I tell you? All right. So I am almost finished setting up. I'm going to take these, these pencils out because I don't really need that many pencils. Okay. Okay, these are my leads and my other stuff. All right, so here we go. <laughs> um, okay, so first, these are my... Uh, colors of the world markers here and I just like to keep these with me because when I am coloring I like to have um, flesh tone markers with me these are my micron pens that come in different colors here uh, they come in the the red, the purple, the green. I have two blacks. I believe one is a 08 and one is a 05. Brown and blue. And I just like to keep them in this rubber band here so that everything is all neat and tidy together. These pencils I did in a previous video that you guys uh, saw. And these were the Comfort Mate Ultra mechanical pencils by Papermate. So I have these two. This is a new product from Papermate Clearpoint line. And these mechanical pencils are actually the color of the pencil here, the the holder, pencil holder. So there's the paper a purple paper lead. <laughs> there is a purple lead, excuse me, and there is a blue lead. So these are a purple lead and a blue lead. All right, this is the older um, mechanical pencil that I had from before. I'm probably going to finish this out because I believe I have two more of these left. So I'll keep that just in case. And here are the um, Pilot Friction Pens. Uh, these are pens that, they are actually pens. I am still a little bit intimidated with writing or drawing with pens right now. So I still stick to pencils, which is why I'm glad that I purchased the color lead pencils, which was, which were these here that I just recently showed you. I'm glad that I <laughs> have color pencils and I have color pens. So these are the friction color pens here and they come in the red purple i think this is the dark blue blue and a fuchsia color 
All right, so those are those. And I love these when I saw them on Project Runway. I love looking at Project Runway because all of the, uh, the stylists, the artists, the, the, uh, people who make the clothing, this is what they use to draw with. So love that idea. Okay, and then here, these are just regular pencils that I have. Um, I have the, this one is the Fiber Castell Jumbo Pencil. Love this. This is like for graphite work when I do do that. These are my other two graphite pencils that I have. Uh, these are uh, a different brand that I got from the 99 cent store and they write very good as well. So I love these. This is my handy um, Stratler Mars plastic eraser and this is the lever here, you push it and the eraser comes down. These are perfect for when you want to get into those little corners when you make a mistake or you just want to clean up. This is perfect for that, all right? And you, this goes up and down. You see it moving up and down. I don't know if you can replace the eraser, but I've brought a lot of them. So if you can't replace the eraser, it's fine because I've brought so many of them. All right, now you guys are hearing my heat coming on. These here are, I just have pens, regular pens in my kit so that when I'm finished drawing, I can sign my artwork. Um, these are just normal pens. I love them all. However, this one is my favorite Pentel pen that I love to use, RSVP Fine Point. I love this, love this, love this. This is what this looks like. And you guys have seen this before. I've seen a, a couple of the artists that I watch have this pen, pen as well. And it's just perfect to write with on all occasions. Even if you're um, signing your artwork, it's just a perfect pen to have in your bag. All right, and here is my favorite, 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 can't live without Fiber Castell, uh, Pit Artisan pen and this just helps you to um, draw with the fine lines and just make your artwork more bold. They do have these in other, other colors but right now this is my favorite tool to use and very handy in your art case, in your art pencil case. Alright, this is uh, another famous pencil I believe these this comes in blue also sometimes you have the red tip and then you have the blue tip on this end but this just happens to be a red pencil that I have used also also I have my prism color premier marker here and this is to uh, fill out the colors like when you're when you are coloring in with the prism colors, this is to help make the color and look a little bit smoother. All right. I, I've been trying to open this for the longest while. I haven't been able to open it yet, but right now when I am ready to use it, it'll work. <laughs> and then my last but not least is the, um, Afmat electric race eraser here. I love this thing. Love, love, love. You can interchange the erasers to be a thick point like this. And I also have them in a smaller point. And you would change this little barrel here. For the smaller one, which is really thin, it is a gray plastic nib that you would put in here and you would put the eraser in attach the eraser to it and um, it works perfectly to get into those fine lines and this is also very good for quickness all right I have a regular eraser here I have my feather my duster here to erase all of those little extra eraser 
you know, things like when you're erasing, it's so messy. This is just a quick erase. It erases it quickly and um, it's a good tool to have as well. All right. The rest that I have are uh, the fiber castell pencil case for when I need to sharpen my jumbo pencil. And you can also uh, sharpen a regular pencil as well. All right, so that's that. And I have a fiber castell eraser here. This, I keep leads with me, so this is just a paper mate lead points. I also have uh, staple lead points. Uh, this is 07, 07 there. So when I run out, I can refill. This is an, another paper mate one as well. And I just have extra erasers for that comes in this cute little container here. So it's extra erasers for the electric eraser. So as I erase and the eraser goes down, I can just switch them out. And these are the bigger erasers that I, that came in, came with the, this pencil here, which is what I was talking to you guys about before, which is the paper made clear point pencil and the eraser you twist the eraser it's there this eraser here looks like these and I just like to keep these just in case I don't have the big eraser these work just as well all right and then of course I have my trusty sharpener for those occasions when I need to sharpen my pencils uh, I carry this with me I did have another one um, a silver one but I misplaced it, but um, this works just as well. I would suggest that you have at least two sharpeners with your um, with in your art pencil case, because you never know. And let me show you. I don't think I showed you how this worked, but this is the Fiber Castell. For those of you who have, you already know what to do. You push this out here, and it easily opens up into the jumbo pencil and the regular size pencil and when you want to clean the the erase the uh sharpen it has a little case in there to hold the uh sharpeners then when you want when you sharpen your pencil and you can just put this back on close this back like so and just very 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 easy all right and this is my pencil case here that I keep everything in I got this from Staples a while back very trusty very handy if you guys are looking for pencil cases and you want to see everything that's in your pencil case this is the perfect uh, tool to get and once again I got this from Staples all right so that is it for my uh, what's in my art pencil case. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please consider liking and subscribing to my channel and I will see you guys in the next art video. Bye for now.